Okay, so I put 8 AD5B on my A2 and I landed here outside the armistice zone of a mining station. Eight, actually AD4B, size 4. So I'm going to detach them. Oh, I can't. I cannot detach them. Why? Oh, I can detach this one, but uh, that I cannot detach. There we go. That's 1 AD4B. There we go. 2 AD4B. Ooh. Oh, there we go. That one on top. Detached. And that one over there. Okay. Nice. So these are the 4 AD4Bs. They should be able to detach from there. So let me try something else. Okay. So let's try over here. Huh. Doesn't look like we can detach those two weapons from the A2. Let's try that one. Oh, this one we can. There we go. Detached. Drop it. That one. Easily we can detach it. Okay. I think that should be a bug because um, um, that turret over there should be able, we should be able to, to detach those two weapons. But somehow we're not able to. Because those weapons are, are outside. And we can even detach the, those two main guns from up, up top. Okay. Uh, All right, so the next test is to see if we can remove the ballista missiles and put it back on. If we can, which means we can have unlimited missiles for the ballista, right? It will be even more deadly. Jump town. Okay, this is outside armor system. And let's test it over here. Unlock the sign. Hmm. I don't understand. Let's try it. Oh, there we go. So we can remove the Gatling gun from the ballista on top over here. Oh, weapon system destroyed. I can hear the, the, the vehicle system saying that. Destroyed. Weapon system destroyed. Okay, so we successfully removed the Gatling gun from the ballista. And the missiles. Yeah. I don't think we can. Huh. You know what? Let me turn the turret, the missile turret on. Power on. Weapons online. Anvil aerospace. And let me press the unlock button. Yes, I did. I press the unlock button. Let's get out and try it. Oh, we cannot. Even this big missile outside, we cannot. I don't think they give us the option to do so. Yeah. We cannot. Let me see the Gatling guns. Huh. Oh, even when you when you tr when you drag a weapon, you can even see the you see the like the red circle over there. That's that's dismatch means you you cannot put the gun over here. You also see the white circles. That means this matches whatever weapon you're dragging. It matches the the weapon's port on that vehicle. And you can even see the other vehicles around you. That's good. That's nice. But you don't see um, you don't see this uh, blessed missile port like anything like circle, even red or for. So there is no unlimited blessed missiles. So that's tested for now. If any one of you find a way to remove the ballista missile and put it back on, please let us know. Next test. Guys, something is really weird. Usually I can expedite my, my ballista right away, but right now even I expedite it, it still gave me over almost two minutes to wait. Well, let's do our next test then, and then we'll figure that out. Selected. What happened to Stand the by. insurance reclaiming time? Okay, there we go. Thank you. And please visit again. All right, opening weapons ports. I don't see the word, but I did press the keybind to unlock the 
weapons port on the ship. So, let's test this. If this works, we can have unlimited ballistics for the Centurion. Alright, let's test the first. Oh, there we go. We can remove the side 3. Artrition 3 repeater. Nice. And, oh! Nice! Wow! Okay. I think this works, guys. This works. That means we can have unlimited ballistics for the Centurion. If you put full ballistics for the Centurion. Even though the ballista, we cannot have unlimited missiles. That failed. But... Yeah, but... Uh, oh, let me put it down first. Let's not celebrate too early. Okay. Let's put it down over here. Nice! Two. I'm having problem. Road. Oh, three. Four. Done! Let me see if I can remove them easily. Oh, there we go. We did it. We can have unlimited ballistics for the Centurion, guys. That's crazy. That's nice. Okay, let me put this back on. Okay. That's nice. This opens a lot of possibility for the Centurions, for the AAs on the ground. And let's see my A2. Where is A2? Okay, I'm going to destroy my A2 for test. Let's see. Ooh. I don't think it's enough to de destroy the A2 with shield on. 400 rounds. Oh, we did it. Oh, wow. So we basically use about, let's say, 800 to 700, around 800, yeah, don't, yeah, less than 800 rounds, of course, times four, to destroy an A2 with full shield on. Stay away from me, stay away from me. Okay, but the thing is, if you wanna, if you are buying them from the store, from the, it's pretty expensive. So I don't think it's cost effective to put a lot of those AD4Bs unless you put them back to another ship for these. Let's see. Uh, these are empty. Oh, let me see if I remove them, right? These are empty. So I remove them. Will they stay empty? Or how do I know it's empty? There is no any indication of uh, the ammo count. If I just look at this weapon over here, it doesn't say anything. So, but uh, let's see. Wow, we did a lot of destruction here. There we go. Okay, now I am going to put them back on. See if the <laughs> see if the ammo automatically restore or not. I hope not, because that that would be a glitch, and uh, we have to fix it. But let's just give a test. If that's a glitch, we'll just tell CIG we need to change it. Where is the... Uh, yeah, there we go. Put the weapon on. Okay, four. Done. Uh, we took them all out. We put them all back on. So let's see right now if we have uh, our ammo replenished or not. Nope, it's not. Okay, looks like there is no bug here. So it's empty. But uh, by just looking at the weapon itself, you cannot know. So that's a thing. All right, you know what? Not the test. If we reclaim this vehicle, will we still have those AD4 beasts on this vehicle or not? All right, so let's confirm this. Right now, let's uh, reclaim the Centurion, right? Claim. You see, the Envo Centurion delivery time is seven minutes. Uh, I don't know what what is in currently in the live server, uh, 3.18.2. How long is the Centurion's del delivery time? Your because insurance claim has if been I sent. pay expedition, uh, ex expedited fee, which is about 3,000 AUC, it's okay. You. But you still have to wait for two minutes. I think they increased the insurance timer for those vehicles. It definitely increased the insurance timer. So we have to wait for two minutes for this. But uh, before we do that, let's uh, let's test this. I have the second MT. Let Vehicle me call this selected. one. Just do a really quick test. Oh, those missiles are kind of inside this thing. I don't think. I think we can remove this gun. 
but I don't think we can remove those missiles. If we can, that would be awesome. Okay, now let's get tractor beam. What? Oh, we can! Holy moly! Oh! Oh, we can remove the missiles on the Cyclone MT. So each MT has four size two. Dominator, that's really good missile. And you fire from the ground vehicles. The flare, the ships can very difficult to flare out. So I removed it and I put it back. Holy moly, I am gonna be playing with this a lot because this is my favorite thing, especially with the AA. Secondly, I love it. Oh, okay. Okay. Wow. A little bit. Uh, Dangerous. I don't know if you remove the missile like this. I don't know whether it would damage the vehicle or not. Eventually, it will explode if you do too much of this. Oh, oh, oh! But this opens up a lot of possibilities. I removed four Dominator missiles from the second MT. Now I'm gonna put all of them back. Putting them back is a lot easier, I think. Or not? There is going to be a better way to just need a practice. There we go. Oh, you actually don't have to get too close to the missile's port. Just uh, hover it above it. There we go. Oh, easy. Easy, easy. Okay. Oh, in third person, you can even see it. Oh, there we go. Done. Four missiles, put it down. Take a little bit of time. I think I'm still a little bit rusty. Need to practice a lot. System check. Four missiles. Let's target. Yeah, let's just fire straight ahead. Blind firing them. Ready? Fire. Look at that. Wow, nice. <laughs> yeah, it takes two seconds to fire, but it takes two minutes to put those weapon uh, missiles on. All right, let's go check our... Centurion situation. Okay. Centurion's out. Oh, no. Okay, so that's an active. Um, when you switch, switch those weapons, if you reclaim it, I think everything goes back to default. I think this is actually really good. They should be doing things like this, including your ship. I have not tested the ship yet, but I assume from 3.19, once you reclaim your ship, everything goes to default. That's just my assumption. So we have to see. But uh, you can see the Centurion. This Centurion is what we switched to 85 Bs. But this Centurion is what we... It's uh, default. But the problem is, you can farm those weapons and sell them, right? If you can find a way to sell those weapons. Because a reclaim a Centurion takes much less money and much less time. And you have four size four laser repeaters you take them out put in your ship and then reclaim it take them out put in your ship and reclaim it in a matter of half an hour you can put like maybe over 20 30 size 4 repeaters and you can go to sell them if you can find a way to sell them makes so much money that's an exploit i think that should not be permitted to do so we'll have to see uh when because right now it's all in ptu is everything's in flux so things can change anytime all right, so this is good. You know what? Let's do another bonus content. Let's try the Cyclone AA. That's my favorite ship. I mean vehicle. All Thank right. you, and please visit again. Let's try it. Oh, ah, uh, forgot to unlock. <laughs> All right, let's try it. Oh, it doesn't look like... Oh, we can. Pull it down. Oh. Come out. Ooh, we can! Wow, amazing! We can! A little bit uh, dangerous though. Look at this. Quite dangerous. But, we can. However, this thing is, you don't have to drag those missiles out. It's difficult. You just fire them, right? Basically, you put it in and fire them. Put it in to fire them. So, that's... The dragging them out, dragging those missiles out is not a... Like, a big issue here. So, how to put it in? Easily. Oh, that easy? Oh my. I'm playing around with this a lot. 
I'm gonna make some other really good content for this. This is this is amazing. That easy? No, that's not that. E oh, there we go. Two missiles inside the uh, Cyclone AA. Wow. <laughs> bravo, bravo. This is good. Yeah, because the pilot can um, shoot those missiles. For the Cyclone IMT, you have to go to the tourist seat. So you when you get into position, and then you 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 lock your. I think I did one in jump town um, the especially against light fighters two dominator missile two size two dominator if you fire at a gladius if the gladius cannot if all, both hit a gladius will be heavily damaged yeah and then it's really difficult to flare off those missiles if you fire from the ground vehicle oh there is a ship over here over there okay ready <laughs> sorry Fire! Oh, what? I hear something. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, this is it for this video. Actually, we did a lot in this video. I was planning only to test the Ballista and the Centurion, but we also tested the uh, Cyclone MT and the Cyclone AA. And then the results are these. You cannot remove the missiles from the ballista. But you can remove and put the weapons for the Centurion. So you can not have unlimited missiles for the ballista, but you can have unlimited ballistics for the Centurion. And also you're able to detach and attach uh, new missiles for the Cyclone MT. And you can also put more missiles for the Cyclone AA. That's really nice. I'm really excited. Can't wait for 3.19 to go live and use these in the most creative way that we can think of. <laughs> so stay tuned, guys, and thanks for watching. Oh, by the way, also in the video, we we saw that there are some insurance change for uh, the vehicles and the ships. I'm not exactly sure what it is, but just be mindful that it has been changed. The insurance timer and uh, the X expedited fee are all changed at least for these vehicles i think for the ship as well but we have to do more tests on those as well all right guys thanks for watching see you in the next one bye